Rakim Hashim Allen, better known to the world as PNB Rock, was a shining light in the music industry. His journey from the streets of Philadelphia to the global stage was nothing short of inspirational. His unique style of hip-hop, blending melodic flows with introspective lyrics, resonated with millions. PNB Rock's ability to weave personal experiences into his music created a deep connection with his audience, making him a standout artist in a crowded field. His music offered a glimpse into his life, his struggles, and his triumphs. Each song was a chapter of his story, filled with raw emotion and authenticity. Fans found solace and strength in his words as he spoke about overcoming adversity and chasing dreams. Tragically, his promising career was cut short on September 12, 2022, in a senseless act of violence. The news of his untimely death shocked the world, leaving a void that could never be filled. PNB Rock was more than just an artist, he was a father, a son, and a friend. His love for his family was evident in everything he did, and he often spoke about the importance of staying grounded and true to oneself. His loss sent shockwaves through the music community and beyond, leaving fans and fellow artists grappling with grief and disbelief. The outpouring of love and support from around the world was a testament to the impact he had on so many lives. The circumstances surrounding his death, a robbery turned fatal at a Los Angeles restaurant, only added to the tragedy. It was a stark reminder of the senseless violence that plagues our society and the fragility of life. In the wake of his passing, it's important to remember PNB Rock for his artistry, his positive impact on those around him, and the legacy he leaves behind. His music continues to inspire, offering a beacon of hope and resilience. His story serves as a stark reminder of the devastating consequences of gun violence. The music industry and society as a whole must come together to address this pressing issue and work towards a safer future. This is the story of PNB Rock's last hours, a tragic sequence of events that ultimately led to his untimely death. As we reflect on his life and legacy, let us also commit to making a change, ensuring that his story is not just one of loss, but also of hope and transformation. On that fateful Monday afternoon, PNB Rock visited Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles on Main Street in Los Angeles. He was accompanied by his girlfriend, Stephanie Sibunhewang. The couple enjoyed their meal, seemingly unaware of the danger lurking just outside the restaurant. Unbeknownst to PNB Rock, a father and son duo, Freddie Lee Trone and his 17-year-old son were already in the vicinity. According to court documents, the younger Trone had received a ride from a woman named Chantelle Trone, who was later identified as his stepmother. While PNB Rock was enjoying his lunch, the younger Trone allegedly approached the restaurant and spotted the rapper. He then contacted his father who arrived at the restaurant shortly after. The events that unfolded next would forever change the lives of everyone involved. During their meal, Stephanie Sibun Hewang, PNB Rock's girlfriend, shared a photo on her Instagram story. The image showed their food and a location tag at Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles. While seemingly innocent, this post would later become a point of contention, with some speculating that it played a role in the tragedy. Law enforcement officials investigated the possibility that the Instagram post alerted the suspects to PNB Rock's location. However, it remains unclear whether the suspects were already aware of his presence or if the post directly led them to the restaurant. The role of social media in this case highlights the potential dangers of sharing real-time location data online, particularly for high-profile individuals. It serves as a stark reminder of the importance of online privacy and the potential consequences of sharing personal information on public platforms. The Instagram post, while tragic in its connection to the events that followed, remains a subject of debate and speculation. Social media experts have weighed in on the incident, emphasizing the need for caution when sharing real-time updates. High-profile individuals in particular are often advised to delay posting their locations until after they have left a place. Public reactions to the Instagram post have been mixed, with some expressing sympathy for Stephanie, while others criticize the decision to share their location. This incident has sparked a broader conversation about social media safety tips, such as disabling location services and being mindful of what is shared online. In a press conference, law enforcement officials reiterated the importance of online safety and urged the public to be vigilant. Meanwhile, the community has rallied around PNB Rock's family, offering support and condolences during this difficult time. A memorial has been set up at the restaurant with fans and loved ones paying their respects. This tragic event serves as a poignant reflection on the impact of social media in our lives and the unforeseen consequences it can sometimes bring. The discussions about online privacy and safety continue as society grapples with the balance between sharing and protecting personal information. Ultimately, the Instagram post and its aftermath underscore the need for greater awareness and responsibility in our digital interactions. As PNB Rock and Stephanie Saibun Hewang finished their meal, a lone figure approached their table, 
It was the younger Trone who, according to court documents, brandished a handgun and demanded jewelry and other valuables from the rapper. Witnesses described a chaotic scene as the robbery unfolded. Patrons scattered for cover as the gunman fired at least one shot, striking PNB Rock. The assailant then fled the restaurant with the stolen items, escaping in a getaway car driven by his father. The sound of gunfire shattered the afternoon peace, leaving chaos and fear in its wake. Witnesses recounted the harrowing moments as they realized the gravity of the situation. The restaurant, once filled with the aroma of fried chicken and the chatter of diners, was now a crime scene. Section 5. A City Mourns. News of the shooting spread like wildfire across social media. Fans and fellow artists expressed their shock and disbelief as the severity of PNB Rock's injuries became apparent. He was rushed to a nearby hospital, where medical professionals fought valiantly to save his life. However, their efforts proved futile. PNB Rock succumbed to his injuries, leaving behind a legacy cut tragically short. The loss of the young artist sent shockwaves through Los Angeles and the music industry as a whole. Tributes poured in from all corners of the hip-hop community. Rappers, singers, producers, and fans alike mourned the loss of a rising star. PNB Rock's music, once a source of joy and inspiration, now served as a poignant reminder of the fragility of life. Section 6. The Arrests in the immediate aftermath of the shooting, the Los Angeles Police Department launched a full-scale investigation. Detectives worked tirelessly, gathering evidence, interviewing witnesses, and pursuing every lead. Their efforts soon led them to the Trone family. The younger Trone, whose name remains confidential due to his age, was arrested and charged with murder, robbery, and conspiracy. His father, Freddie Lee Trone, was also apprehended and charged with murder, robbery, and conspiracy. Chantel Trone, the woman who allegedly drove the getaway car, was taken into custody and charged with one count of accessory after the fact. The arrests brought a semblance of closure to a grieving community, but the pain of PNB Rock's loss lingered. Section 7. The Charges The Los Angeles County District Attorney's Office filed charges against the three individuals implicated in PNB Rock's murder. The younger Trone, despite his age, faces the most serious charges, including murder, robbery, and conspiracy. His father, Freddie Lee Trone, also faces murder, robbery, and conspiracy charges. Chantal Trone, the alleged getaway driver, faces one count of accessory after the fact. The charges reflect the gravity of the crime and the devastating impact it had on PNB Rock's family, friends, and fans. The legal proceedings are ongoing, and the defendants are presumed innocent until proven guilty. The outcome of the case will likely hinge on the evidence presented, witness testimonies, and the arguments made by both the prosecution and the defense. Despite the tragic circumstances surrounding his death, PNB Rock's legacy extends far beyond the events of that fateful day. His music continues to resonate with millions, offering a glimpse into his life, his struggles, and his triumphs. He was more than just an artist, he was a father, a son, and a friend. His infectious smile, his positive energy, and his genuine spirit touched the lives of those who knew him personally and those who connected with his music. PNB Rock's legacy is one of resilience, perseverance, and the power of music to transcend boundaries. He used his platform to share his story, to inspire others, and to spread a message of hope. PNB Rock's death sent shockwaves through the music industry, prompting conversations about artist safety, gun violence, and the role of social media. His murder served as a stark reminder of the dangers that artists face, particularly in an era where their every move can be tracked online. In the wake of his passing, many artists spoke out about the need for increased security measures, both at public events and in their personal lives. The tragedy also reignited discussions about gun control and the need for stricter legislation to prevent such senseless acts of violence. PNB Rock's death, while a devastating loss for the music industry, also served as a catalyst for change. It forced a reckoning within the industry, prompting artists, labels, and event organizers to prioritize safety and security. The tragic death of PNB Rock is a stark reminder of the pervasive issue of gun violence that plagues our society. This heartbreaking event underscores the devastating impact that gun violence has on families, communities, and the nation as a whole. It is a somber reflection of the urgent need for change. It highlights the urgent need for comprehensive solutions to address this epidemic that continues to claim innocent lives. The ripple effects of such violence extend far beyond the immediate victims, affecting the mental health and well-being of entire communities. We must recognize the depth of this crisis and the necessity for immediate action. This incident should serve as a call to action for lawmakers, community leaders, and individuals alike to come together and find meaningful ways to prevent such tragedies from occurring in the future. It is imperative that we engage in open and honest discussions about the root causes of gun violence and work collaboratively to implement effective strategies. It is a collective responsibility to create a safer environment for everyone. 
This means not only enacting stricter gun control laws, but also addressing the socioeconomic factors that contribute to violence. Community safety initiatives must be prioritized and adequately funded to ensure they have a lasting impact. We must work towards enacting sensible gun control measures, investing in community-based violence prevention programs, and fostering a culture of peace and respect. Education and awareness campaigns can play a crucial role in changing attitudes towards violence and promoting non-violent conflict resolution. It is only through collective action that we can hope to break the cycle of violence and create a society where everyone feels safe and secure. By standing together and supporting one another, we can build a future free from the fear of gun violence, where every individual has the opportunity to thrive in a peaceful environment. Rakim Hashim Allen, the man behind the stage name PNB Rock, was more than just a statistic, more than just a headline. He was a talented artist, a loving father, and a valued member of the music community. His life, 